Up here, having a hot start. Top of the net worth. And, you know, with this Mask of Madness and hitting the jungle, it's only going to continue. You know, his farm and staying on top. Mask of Madness into the Dragon Lance. Play versus Beastmaster, DK. Like this whole pushing kind of draft style, and they're not actually taking your towers. You're able to farm jungle. You're very happy. Fishman even just dropping Tombstone to hold the tower top. So I feel like Entity, they're pretty happy with this. I mean, Fishman, he could be tempting here for Weeha. Yeah, they'll use the raw setup straight in. More money but for the leader. These two cores, they're under the tower. Let's see if they can punish this, Toby. Caught by the Light Strike Array, but the chase downs here. Coming in from the side, Katomi and Stormstorm. Are they going to look to go straight for the big kill? Straight for Weeha. And indeed, as much farm as he may have in this early game, free BKB, if they get on top of the Lina, there's not a chance for Weeha to survive. I think they got baited on. I think he showed mid, they stunned him with Nyx Assassin, pushed him out of lane. I believe they saw him bottom for a quick second there somehow. I saw them ping him right away. He should have a solid chance of taking down Toby here top. The smoke straining onto him. Ancient seal. And they have the burst. They'll take down the DP. We've seen Katomi maybe eyeing up opportunities to catch anyone left behind. Further TP's coming Ooh. in from Entity. Tries to play around with the Spike Carapace, but won't trip up Weeha. That's going to be fine. Katomi falling very low, but the Stick Charges are available. And now Entity, they've turned up in their numbers, Alliance. They've got to start considering getting out of her, at least how they're going to be able to do so. We'll see. Trying to turn and take down the... That's what you're saying. Yeah, the Carapace. One stun. Pure. It has a Brigand's Blade also finished up with Haste Rune, so he wants to fight. And Dekarlis, gonna head straight up into the high ground, trying to start some sort of a fight. Look towards Pure, but Pure pots the BKB Alliance. They've got to run from this SF, as they'll try and get themselves back safely, but already Fishman's in on top of them. The Tombstone dropped down. We are pots the BKB in an attempt to turn. They've got the Stone Controller onto Limitless. It's three dead on Alliance. And it's right next to Roche. Yeah, so they're gonna move straight into there. They have you know, insane amounts of damage here with Pure on the SF. It is so Pure, he's just taking the tier two by himself, bottom. They're gonna try and smoke up. Now keep Pure revealed down bottom, so Alliance might not expect the rest of Entity to be swinging back at them as quickly as they are. It's Entity, they'll head back over to the jungle. Stormstormer looking to start things. Look towards Aramis, they'll turn with the Ancient Seal and the Raw onto Stormstormer, but they cannot stick around to finish him off as Aramis gets taken out limitless tries for the tp but pure he's back over and with the fear puts a cancel to the tp out from limitless as they'll clean up the two of them and they're knowing their strength now fishman he has the gold for the mech and he just says no people do they have sentries on anybody right now no sentries on anyone as i think the stream died again i see just in case the stream's still there here comes the smoke <laughs> Oh, yeah. Okay, we're good. He's going to find Dekarlis. Couple of hits. <laughs> Literally a couple of hits. Dekarlis is gone. Same to be said for Aramis. Weeha, he'll make oh, it out in time. Lucky. I mean, playing a bit risky there, going for the TP out without popping the BKB. He'll get away with it. Them here. Alliance, maybe, get it. maybe going for a cute little wrap around here. Hey, this could catch him by surprise. They can get on pure. Can they get the jump on the SF? They see the hawk. They have the hawk there. Oh, it's a good start. It's a very good start. In with the Dragon Tail. Pure, is, I think somebody get the BKP off. He's dead. Okay. They got the kill. Now, can they get more? They're over towards Fishman. We'll see Toby heading straight away into the middle of the fight with the Exorcism. We'll get the BKB off and he'll start to force back Alliance. Lose Aramis. Nico, baby. He's, He's been sort of pushed off towards the side. Katomi's in with the stun. He'll get separated from the rest of the team. He'll turn with the Dragon Tail stun. Falls to the side. He's trying to run. He's alive. And he'll make it. He'll get away from them. As Alliance will still lose to Carlis. They will still opt to continue the retreat. But Katsomi is not going to let it happen. He's in with the jump. He's in on top of Weeha. Buybacks are coming out now from Alliance. To Carlis, he'll buy back an attempt to keep Weeha safe. But they catch him in the stun. Weeha goes down. Toby cleaning up with the double. They're blocking off as well the escape here from Limitless. We'll get forced to safety. Toby. Nico, baby. Trying to get back in him with another stun over towards Toby. They're keeping him control with the stun of the center. Katom, he's into the base, but immediately he has silenced by the Agent Seal. Entity, they may have stepped a little too far. They're up to the high ground. Stormstormer goes for the TP out. They oh. won't be able to cancel it, so he'll escape. A Super pretty luck. fortunate fight for Alliance. Ooh, that's oh, that's easy on this SF. You might not want to go near him. Them. They're going to drop the Tombstone straight away. Uh, and maybe look for a chance to, to take this. At least take a, a fight. Early. I mean, Stormstorm is heading up into the triangle. They're going to look to get the fight started. Nico Baby's in with the BKB in with the stun. He's on straight away on top of Pure. The SF eliminated. They'll turn towards Stormstormer Alliance. Keeping this triangle held safe and making sure that Entity, they don't get any sort of chance to head into the pit. Now Alliance and now themselves, they they'll take a okay, difference. 
sometimes the volatility of Shadow Fiend. We Look got to, we got to see it back to back. You know, he gets caught. Hero can be fairly squishy. Great execution from Alliance. I mean, yeah, excellent play around that triangle. You know, off the back of that sort of setup that they went for on Pure, and then the fact that uh, Entity kind of walked into it. See Alliance? Now stepping pretty deep, trying to get the action uh -oh. going. We are... Oh my goodness, you <laughs> have a slide away from that stun just in time. Of course, did have the Aegis, even if he does get taken down. As it is, he'll lose his two supports. They get he left might have behind. died twice there, honestly. Ducalus' four staff may have bailed them out of a horrific situation. <laughs> coverage as well, Alliance. Yeah. Ward coverage and Hawks, right? I think they have three Hawks right now. Aramis. Very, very quick to blink away there. Do Entity still want to fight this? Toby seems tempted, but they're going to be able to turn. They get the stun off onto Toby. They'll be able to break him out of the Mystic Flare combo with the full stop. Toby's able to put the BKB. Turns with the Siphon, but there's still the physical damage. He's done it from Weeha at the high ground. Just punching them down. He'll turn towards Pure, but the BKB's out. Protecting him for the Light Strike Ray. Pure trying to step forward, but Alliance, they've got the speed to step back. Both teams lost their tank. Their frontliners, they're both dead. See if they can all get out here. Oh, oh Carlos, no he will get caught. Quick stun and one swipe there from Pure. And if I'm not mistaken, that was the gem. I think Nico Baby was holding it right High ground. And they come out ahead. So that's a pretty big indicator of things. The tombstone gets addressed really quickly, but they're still able to stand their ground with yeah. Pure. He's very much sort of with these Lincolns and four stuff. Oh, we are! Oh. oh, get him out of it! That silence, that ancient seal onto Kataomi. Oh will very much save Weeha's life. If that Ancient Seal didn't come out from Aramis, we would have been seeing a dead leaner on our screens. Yeah. That's also the death and that extra charge. Alliance, they'll smoke up themselves. Do they want to try and take this fight into the Aegis? So that's the question, because it's still there for two minutes on pure. They attempt for a jump in. Toby's Won't be able to get it now. Toby, he just full commits. He's in with the BKB off to the side of Weeha with these right clicks. Tears through him. And Toby will go down. Dakar is forced to the side as a try and run. But he'll get caught by the right click of Pure. Double kill for Storm Stormer. I mean, they got Toby though. 90 That's seconds. It. There's no DP. So a lack, a lack, lack of pushing potential. We are. Perhaps, ooh, perhaps he's telling one of his teammates, he's probably like, guys, one of you needed to link into me. I just got roared. So next time, maybe if he looks to go for this type of an aggressive play. I mean, Elias are ready to try for more. They break the linkers, they're in with the combo. Stormstorm's in trouble, he'll get forced to the side, but he goes down. Pure tries to get in on top of Weeha, but the BKB was off in time, so the, the Requiem not doing much at all. Weeha, he's going to be able to keep his distance, get out, and if anything, he's going to be ready to get back in. They'll look towards Pure, they pop through the link because he's been caught Thousand by... Thousand gold, but Toby has Aeon Disc. They get the jump. And here's the damage. You see this here with the raw control. We'll be able to get the stone form off. And the bird's in as well. A couple of stuns out onto Weeha. They'll have to force him back to safety, but now Weeha is ready to turn. Forces that out was both on this from Toby. Jump for Katomi's in. He gets the stun onto Weeha. Weeha's in trouble. He's gone. That's what they had to do, and they'll do it there. The buybacks will come out from Alliance. So they can continue to fight back at this. They've lost their racks, though. Weeha's going to be so careful. There's the BKB pop. Stays on top of Pure. The right click's coming in. Pure's gone the once. Weeha now turns towards Stormstormer. They're on top of the BKB starting to come to an end. Weeha has to keep his distance. Getting himself back towards the fountain. Toby able to blink away as Nico Baby's in on top of them. Tries to turn towards Pure, but he's caught by the spike carapace. And that's Aramis. Die back. Out for 80 seconds. Entity. They get the racks on the top lane. And they're ready it's... to go for more. It's so scary for Weeha. He has no BKB, no buyback. Okay, he's stepping One up. One stun and he could just die. He's got to be so cautious. He dies in his game over Pure. He's in with the Requiem. Weeha's off to the side. Immediate buyback from Dakarlis. Weeha tries to turn. He's looking towards Pure, but a four staff gets Pure outside of the way. The range of Weeha's leaner. Now turning towards Katsumi. I mean, they open up with the Raw. They'll take him out, but at the damage, it's been done again. The mid set of racks also cleaned up by Entity. Oh, man. Uh, it's it's the... completely done. Completed as uh, maybe more, well, yeah, there is no more sensible item for him to buy. He's 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 completely done, completed as you'd expect to be if you're walking around with 53k net worth. I'm completely done with the build. Alliance. Might find Storm Storm. No, Storm Storm's gonna find them. No turn with the hex. The force. Can Tommy get to the side? They're not Tommy. They've got the stone. They've got the fear. They've got the kills. They step outside of the base, and that will be that. Dead, no buyback. GG. They tried to go for that risky move, but it, yeah, straight away in with the stun. They're gone. GG's called Entity. We'll be able to take this game one. A long one, though, at that 55 minutes in.
You know, Alliance, they tried their best, but uh, at the end of it all, it was always going to have that, that sort of vulnerability, right, Bob? Yeah, I mean, it was entity dominance of, especially of gold.